Hello and good morning, y'all, and welcome to Left Behind. Now, this is a demo I just saw on Itch, and it seems pretty damn cool. I guess we're gonna be playing as a guy named Lucas who is looking for like this mysterious house that like eludes a lot of people, and we're gonna be in the forest at night, and spooky stuff's gonna happen. It seems kind of Blair Witch in a way, but I don't know. Uh, but I'm gonna have a link to it in the description if you want to check it out yourself. But I'm just gonna press start, hop into it, see what we got left behind. Let's see what's up with this. This is just a short horror experience demo, and you may encounter bugs and error throughout the game. This demo does not represent the final product. Yada yada yada. Okay. We have like a nice like little even like intro screen here. How quaint. February 26, 2016. Okay, so a couple years back. 5.18 p.m. This must be the place I was looking for. This this truck's seen better days. I am determined to prove them wrong about the existence of that house. A friend of mine actually told me about this house. Sadly, she was sentenced to death after being convicted of murdering the staff members at a nearby asylum. Hold up, we're not just going to glance over that, are we? <laughs> And we're just glancing over this? Okay! <laughs> I guess that's all that needed to be said. Why would that be important, you know? Alright, this game's very... I'm gonna bump the audio up. Bump that up a little bit. It's very quiet. Okay. Okay, I think we're good. Just the sounds of nature. And my beautiful truck that really shouldn't be wor uh, working anymore. Okay. So I guess we're on our way to find this house. Wherever it may be. What could possibly go wrong just going deep in the forest alone? Looking for an ancient demon house. Nothing really, you know? I've heard that this house is somewhere around here, and apparently it only appears at night. Yeah, perfect. What could possibly go wrong with a demonic only appears at night house in the middle of the forest? With my only getaway be vehicle being a just rusted through Ford. And the only reason why I know it exists is my friend who's in the asylum for killing a bunch of people. I really hope I don't come across any bears, because as we all know, everything in the forest is out to get you, I think is what that said. Yes, the bears are the problem here. Not the spooky demon house. The bears. The good old Chicago bears. I would have made a sports ball joke, but I don't know if they win or lose anymore. I dropped out of sports like in 2004 or so. I still enjoy them. I just don't watch them. Just follow the path, Lucas. Follow the path. Okay. Okay. In fact, these are quite clearly tire marks. Why don't we just keep driving? I mean, I guess that rusted through Ford wasn't going to make it. These are some intense hills, but th these are quite clearly like tire marks in the ground. Alright. I don't know if we're going to the right or the left. I'm thinking the left. I'm going to go to the left. I'm a lefty, so I always trust the left side, you know? I think it's the right way. You know what? I'm a lefty, so I've been told my entire life everything is wrong. I get graphite in my hands whenever I use a pencil. No scissors are really made for me properly. I always bump elbows with other people eating at tables. You know? This, this could never be right. When I saw that house and snapped a photo of it, it became, I became an instant celebrity. My name was all over the headlines. Okay. Snapped a photo of it? Or do you snap a photo of another house? Ooh, that's like a tent. Hello. Hold on a second. Is that a campsite? It seems like someone else is here. They were here. It appears as though it's been left here for quite some time. Yeah, no, it has. It's almost like we shouldn't be going out here. 
I can hang out here until I wait for nightfall. No, okay. Sometimes you just play a protagonist and you're like, you know what? You deserve it. Like, you just genuinely deserve it. Can I, like, crouch in here? It's almost dark out, so I really need to start a fire. A fire. Oh. Conveniently, there was a campfire here. Thank the goodness, you know? Alright. Oh, my back hurts. This tent is very comfortable. You would even, like, check the tents. Like, what if the tent had, like, I don't know, mad cow disease or some shit in it? <laughs> Alright, let's go find that darn house. I'm gonna guess up here. Alright. Can we climb up this way? No. Oh, is it gonna be down the left path? Are we going down this path? No, I think we gotta go down here. It seems about right. Wait. No, okay, so you can't go down this path anymore. So then, I think... We'll have to go back down the path I wasn't allowed to go down before, which is down this way. I'm thinking then. It's already so dark, it must be around here somewhere. Yeah, good luck finding it. It's dark, dude. I will say, though, visually, this game's really nice looking. It's a bit creepier. I hope this isn't a bad idea. No, it is. It's a horror game. It's an awful idea. We probably got... These trees are probably markers to it, if I had to assume. Like, I assume a lot of this is probably just, like, pre-made asset and whatnot. That house must be big. It can't be hard to find. But, like, it's still, like, a good use of the assets. Like, it looks good. Um... I think the hardest part is going to be finding this house, though. Are we going back down, maybe? I guess. Ooh. Someone's having a fun time. I'm assuming at the house. Ooh, we got windshield wipers. Maybe through here? I don't know. Oh, hello. That looks like a house. Ooh, more windshield wipers. I mean, what was that? Legends were true, here it is. Lock, what should I expect? I should go look for another way in. Okay. House is looking pretty empty, to be honest. Got some furniture, at least. That's good. You got a kitchen in it? Oh my god, we can have food? I swear I saw something in here. Um. Nada. Hmm. Okay. Hi! You just gonna like come down the roof like upside down at me like that? <laughs> okay. I'm assuming that's the entirety of the demo. Is that it? Yeah, okay. Honestly, it was a little walking sim horror thing. Very Blair Witch-ish. 
no complaints of that. I thought graphically it looked nice. Like I'm sure like a lot of its like preset assets and whatnot, but they were used in, like they were used smart. Um, atmosphere was good. Yeah, no real complaints there. That was pretty good for what it was. Not much going on in the demo, but like really set the atmosphere. Okay. And yeah. I'm still kind of curious about that whole, like, killing all the staff in the asylum thing. But we'll, we'll cross that bridge another time. But again, if you want to check this game out yourself, I'll have a link to it in the description. But that's going to do it for this video. Thank you very much for watching. I'll catch you guys again next time. Y'all have a lovely day. And as always, toodles, y'all.